What's going on, everybody? Little Batista 420 back here with a new video. Got a uh, couple awesome, awesome, awesome pickups for, uh, to do for you guys here. I went to uh, Toys R Us today. Actually, I take that back. I went to Toys R Us yesterday and today, actually. I went to two different Toys R Uses. Uh, I got a heads up yesterday that uh, they had the new battle packs in there with uh, the shield and all that. So, uh, after I got off work, I, I got off kind of early. I had seen that they were open until 10 o'clock on a Saturday. So, uh, it was about almost 9 o'clock at that point. So, <clears throat> I took a drive over there. And by the time I got over there, I, uh, as soon as I walked up, I seen the battle pack. The new one with the punk and uh, I take that back with the rock and Cena. With the new WWE title. And uh, I was like, great, they got it. And I just looked and that was the only one I could find. I couldn't find any shield or any uh, Funkadactyls. I was fucking pissed. Searched the whole, not the whole store, but a good portion of the store, just looking around shit and seeing if somebody stashed it. So it was nothing. So a major, major, major disappointment. And uh, so today, today's Sunday, and I decided to a, uh, <clears throat> take a drive over to Toys R Us. Uh, if you guys seen my video earlier today that I that I posted, picked up some amazing figures. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you guys what I picked up today. First figure I got here, right at the top, which is now my favorite Punk figure I have here. When I seen this probably eight months ago, maybe on uh, Comic Con, I wasn't impressed with uh, the face scan. Maybe it ain't been eight months now, but right after WrestleMania, whatever, when they released the the, the stuff on this one, uh, the figure at Comic Con, I didn't really like the face scan. But now that I have it, it is fucking awesome. And all in all, I mean, purple is one of my favorite colors. They got gray and purple and black trunks here. Um, it's got purple and black boots here. I mean, just the colors on this thing and the detail is really awesome. And there's the little Undertaker's urn there. Pretty good storyline if everybody remembers that one when freaking Punk was uh, taking Paul, I mean, uh, Paul Bear's uh, ashes out and like putting them all over him. That was crazy. And there's my first figure, uh, first figure I got today. <clears throat> Second figure I got. Where are we? Right here. Debry. Awesome figure here. The hardest one to find in the in the case. I'm sorry, in the, yeah, in the case. I think there's only one they ship per uh, one dang brand per case. And these are the real WWE t titles. And if you look at the one in the back there, that like Canes, how it looks all copper like a penny. I mean, that's ugly ass title. And these are the ones I liked previous to that. But now the ones that they put here look like fucking real gold. They are just pimp. Face scan on here is awesome. We still gave him more of like the, the open mouth on that one, but I mean, awesome figure. So, and next here, we got a uh, Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar. <laughs> Pretty cool figure here. I'm probably gonna take his uh, his entrance shirt. Off his elite one that I have on his basic, and I'll probably put it on this one. I think it'll kind of cool with the hat there. Nothing really great about this figure. I mean, just another Brock Lesnar. A little different from his other one here. He's got the knee pads on on, that, on his other elite here. His elite 18, I think that one is. Uh, where's Brock at? It's elite 19. Pretty much the same thing, but they got no knee pads on here. And last. Right here. This here is the only reason I went loose with these figures is to get this Paul Heyman. Because I was gonna buy a mock and then keep and keep them, but I was just like, I want this Paul Heyman to build a figure. It's a badass figure, so I went ahead and bought these loose. And I did buy the Cena one too, also, but I gave that one to my uh, my neighbor downstairs. I recently gave his two bro uh, little brothers that live downstairs, both big wrestling fans, and I gave one of them. Uh, Kofi Kingston figure maybe like a month ago whatever and uh, the other one's been kind of sad that I didn't give him a figure so I was coming home today and I seen them outside and if there's any figure I was going to give him it'd be that one so I don't really care too much about the Cena one I just wanted uh, the parts in the Cena so that is that those are all my uh, pickups for today and again I can't get over how freaking awesome this punk is my new favorite punk before it was probably my Elite 16 punk so I just remember like back in the time when the Elite 16s came out when I was trying so hard and hard to find them. So that's it. I got my other punk over here. Recently got some new ink from my uh, from my printer. 
So I reprinted my sign there because if you guys noticed the one before it was all in red and I had no black ink. So I redid that. So that's it, guys. We're going over a little over five minutes here. I'm going to cut this video off. Everybody, uh, thanks for watching. And uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And uh, really quick, I want to thank all my subscribers. Appreciate you guys. Thanks.